Hello friends and welcome to another episode of Magnum Videos. Today we're going to talk about the five E's that can help your channel achieve even greater success. So stick around, I'll be back right after this brief intro. All right, the very first E is the energy factor. If you don't exude a certain amount of energy on your YouTube videos, people are gonna go to sleep, they're gonna click off, and they're gonna go away. Kind of like this. Bueller. 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 You don't wanna do that. You want to put a at least a little bit of energy into your videos. Now, personally, I am not an overly energetic person, and it's a conscious effort for me to add some energy to my videos. And those of you who have watched my videos for a while probably know that. Uh, I'm pretty much a straight and level, laid back kind of guy. I don't get overly excited, but, but overexcitement is something that attracts viewers, and it can keep them watching. So, don't forget to add a little bit of spice, a little bit of energy, a little bit of action to your videos if you want to keep your viewers engaged. And speaking of engagement, you need to engage with the viewer. I see a lot of YouTubers that, especially newer ones, that look at the monitor when they're recording. They're looking to see how they look in the uh, video instead of looking at the lens. That's wrong. You need to keep your eyes on the viewer. Look right into that lens and uh, talk to the viewer. In fact, if you don't, the viewer is going to wonder, who are you talking to? You talking to me? You talking to me? Well, then who the hell else are you talking to? You talking to me? Well, I'm the only one here. And that brings us to E number three, the education factor. YouTube is a massive educational forum. You can find anything you want to know just about on how to do something, get a review on a product, a car, a camera, whatever it happens to be, learn how to cook something. Uh, it's totally education filled. So you are a part of that community and if you have something to teach or something to share, you have education, you have talent, and you have skills. You know, like, Nunchuck skills, bow hunting skills, computer hacking skills. E factor four, entertainment. Now, in addition to being possibly the largest educational format online, YouTube is also perhaps the largest entertainment source on the internet. If you need entertainment, and millions of people utilize the internet for entertainment, you can find just about anything you want. If you are uh, an old movie fan, if you'd like to know the words to the Wells Fargo wagon as they're coming down the street, or yes, my friends, you got trouble right here in River City, you can find that on there. You can watch the video clip from that portion of the movie. And you can probably find the whole movie if you'd like to. If you are a sports nut, and well, I, I didn't mean to call you a nut, I mean a sports fan, and you'd like to see uh, the Muhammad Ali heavyweight fight, the Rumble in the Jungle, you can probably find that on there too. If you are a fan of horse racing, chances are good that you can find an old film of uh, one of the Kentucky Derby races. So it's basically almost anything you can imagine 
you can find on there for entertainment purposes. And as a YouTube creator, you fall under that overarching umbrella known as show business. And as someone once said, and it's as true today as it was the first time it was spoken. There's no business like show business, like no business I know. All right, we're winding down and we're coming up to the bonus uh, factor, which is E number five. And the only thing I could think to call it was ego. And ego is something that is going to be uh, your worst enemy on YouTube if you want to engage with your viewers, uh, gain subscribers, get watch time, etc. Ego will destroy you. Don't use it. Try to be yourself because that's who you are. That's who your viewers want to see. Don't try to buffalo anyone and make them think that you know uh, more than you do because it will come back and bite you. They will see through you like as if you were glass. So be yourself. Be honest and the viewers will get to know you, get to like you, and come back. And I think I will end this with the words of uh, a great man who is a great entertainer, a great educator, and a very wise soul. I like you just the way you are. And there you have it, the five E factors of YouTube success. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you will employ some of those uh, suggestions. And I believe personally that the more of them that you put into action, the more improvement you'll see in your channel. You'll probably get more views, more subscribers, more watch time, and perhaps more income. So that's it for now. Uh, be sure and leave a comment, a question, whatever you'd like to say. And until I speak with you again and even after that, you stay focused.